A witness has come forward claiming to have seen the stabbing that took place Thursday, June 27th in the alley behind the Bank of Montreal in downtown Kelowna. She murdered a perfectly good boy. Chris Cox tells Castanet he was there the night Elijah Ian Beauregard was stabbed in the arm and left a bleed in the street. He was, he was walking around panicking saying like, like the last words I heard him say was help I'm dying. No, I haven't told anybody that until just now. You were there the night that Eli was stabbed? Yes, yes, I was. And what did you see? I walked up and I seen a bunch of blood and Eli holding his arm. And that's when... The, the 100% without a doubt person who did it came up to me and said, I just stabbed Eli. And why did she do that? She told me she stabbed Eli because she won't, he had never been stabbed before. Chris Cox claims he saw the alleged suspect the day after and she was partying like nothing had ever happened. In fact, he believes she may have even visited this makeshift memorial and left the words behind, I'm sorry. On June 28th, an individual identified by investigators as a suspect was taken into police custody. That suspect was later released pending the results of the still ongoing criminal investigation. Pointless. No reason whatsoever. He did not deserve this. No one deserves this. So, but him of all people did not deserve this. He is, he is smiling out of the room. Cox says he met Eli when he was panhandling one day and had known him for almost a year. And you're doing this because why? Eli, for Eli, for some kind of peace and justice for, for his family and him. Cox says he plans to attend Sunday's vigil, and he came forward to tell his story and share it with Castanet in the hopes of providing justice for Eli and peace for his family. Rob Gibson, Castanet News.